going everybody? Welcome back to Reactions with Jay. I am your host Jay and in this video we are going to do a quick reaction to the newest trailer for a movie called Boundaries. Uh, yeah, so it's kind of an interesting concept. So this woman's picking up her father who's a pot dealer with her son and I guess they're driving from I think it's Texas to California and he's like I guess making pot deals all the way on the way back until she meets her ex-husband. That's just what I read in the summary. Let's check it out. Have you spoken with your father recently? He called, but I did not pick up. So you set a boundary. I do notice you have a kitten hidden in your purse. Were you hiding it from me? I think our hour is up. Oh, you finally called me back. You got kicked out of your home, didn't you? We can't have men of such low moral integrity bringing down the place. Oh, please. Dad needs a place to stay. Last time Dad stayed with me, the FBI followed me to work for a week. I oh my gosh, she's such a good actor. Example for Henry. Does this mean I'll get to see you guys? No, I would put him on a plane. I'm not driving that heat cross country. But I'd like to spend some time with you two. Absolutely not. There's two hundred thousand dollars worth of weed in there. I can't unload it on my own. I'll help you. <laughs> Did you change my navigation? He gave me twenty dollars. Henry, hey! Who are these people? Old friends of your grandfather's. Don't inhale anything. No, we cannot take any more dogs. You're like a pipe piper of mange. I don't know why you complain about Jack so much. I like him. Don't hurt my kid. I got through it, but he's different. The mom's not going to like to know who that's going to. Who? Your father. I want to see him. No. Or are you a cypher psoriasis? He's the worst possible man for me. I tell Misty that all the time. Please tell me Misty's your cat. You want me to tell you Misty's my cat? Who is she? My cat. She's your wife, isn't she? She is. I have set a boundary. Hello. It's a line in the sand. In the concrete, actually. Good morning. Family. That's all there is. I used to be able to make you laugh. Oh, damn. Oh, man. <laughs> See? You still laugh. Christ, Jack. I thought you were a Buddhist. Oh, I am. But you bring out the right-wing Christian in me. <laughs> wow, that's interesting. Um, you know what? It's it's kind of weird that it's a family movie because it's rated R. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. You know, like that kind of movie. It should be like a PG. Oh shoot, it can't even be a PG. It's too much marijuana. I mean, I think it should be a PG-13 movie. It, it looks like it's a really interesting uh, concept, though. I mean, I don't really think off the top of my head. I can't think of any movies that have the same sort of idea behind it, you know? Um, but it's interesting that it, I feel like it really reflects the, the times that we're in, you know? I mean, people are different these days. It's not like 20 or 30 years ago where, you know, Grandpa didn't smoke pot or anything like that. But, I mean, I can totally see how there's, like, a moral dilemma. And there's, like, a conflict between her and her father. And obviously there's there's tension because not, not only does she have that, but she's divorced. And, you know, I mean, she's obviously going to struggle as a single mother. And then, you know, I guess there's a disconnect between her and her sister who's in California. Um, I think as a whole movie, it seems like it could really connect with a lot of people and, and the issues that they face. But um, just watching it, though, looking at it, I don't really go to the movie theater to watch family movies. Uh, I would say it's definitely a red box level on my scale of... Um, of uh, Netflix red box movies IMAX yeah definitely a red box level looks like it's gonna be all right it's got some good actors though I think that's something to keep in mind it has good actors but it's rated R so th th that's the weird thing like who is supposed to go and watch this movie like I don't know who's supposed to watch it because it's a family movie but it's rated R I mean you really want to take your kids to watch that movie I don't know. Hey, you tell me in the comments below. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to get to 100 before the end of this month when my wife gets back uh, or she'll think I'm a failure. And when you do subscribe, please go ahead and put your name down below so I remember who you are. That way when we become a big baller YouTuber, I'm going to remember who you guys are. Anyways, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Got